Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video of Los Angeles Chargers franchise. And before we get into this video, I just want to address a few things about the channel. It's been going pretty well, uh, pretty well within the past. Um, it's been going pretty well within these this past month. Um, in terms of views, well. I wouldn't say individual video views, or just said overall views. Um, watch time is really good. Subscriber count was going up. I remember I started this month, I was probably at like, I want to say like 24, 25 subs. I went to almost 40 subs. So by the end of February, I want to hit a goal. I want to hit 50 subscribers by the end of February. And, you know, if you are new here, click that subscribe button and help the channel grow. And I have a... A couple other maybe videos coming. I'm thinking about dipping my hand into the career sim on a 2K side. I might do it some Madden, but I don't know. I'm a little iffy on the career sim. The career resims of... I don't know. I don't know why I'm doing it on Madden. I think I'm going to do it on 2K. I might do three career sims. See how they do. I don't know if I might do three. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I might. And I have another series. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. Once again, I'm just trying to experiment on putting new content out. I've been, I think I've been doing really good with the Madden sense of things. But, yeah, I'm going to try to, like, spread some more content out and do that. So, yeah. Thank you for the support. The subs. The, um, the likes on almost every video. Most of my videos are, most, like I said, most of my videos are doing pretty well. This is the best uh, month I had. Well, really, month I would say a month and a half. This is the best I've ever had it on YouTube. And this most consistent I've been on YouTube. So, you know, the more consistent I get, the more support I get, I guess. Whatever. All right, we are here in week two. I was thinking, like, what is it, week 16? No, we're in week two. And we're coming off a big win against the 49ers, a two-point win against the 49ers. Very close game. We have a breakout player. We're going to see who this is. Tony Burton. Interesting. Really not the player I was expecting. I was thinking Dorian Dell for sure. Like, for sure, for sure. I was thinking Preston Williams, maybe. And then, like, any uh, defensively, I was like, I don't know. Because defense didn't even play that well yesterday. Yesterday, last week. I don't know. Two touchdowns, 100 receiving yards, rushing. I can do that. It's, I can do that. I can do that. We're facing Jalen Ramsey, though. This will be a tough one. Jalen Ramsey. Um, Going to try to slow him down. Probably just not throw to his side. In my opinion, that's what I would do. Yeah, just don't target him. Throw one or fewer intos. We threw one into yesterday, and that was all some bullshit by me. Doctors want to clear Joe Reed. We're not going to do that. That would just be crazy to do. So we are going to start Preston Williams. I thought it said Preston Williams had six touchdowns. I was about to say, how the fuck is that even true? So uh, Joe Reed probably will come back on that bye week, honestly. We have a tough schedule, man. I'm not going to lie. Picking up these wins huge, against like these NFC people will be huge, but we do need to beat the AFC just to have a like uh, a bye week in the future. There's no one to negotiate with. I think we're good, so we're just gonna hop into this game. We did upgrades at the end of the last episode, so we're just gonna leave that at that. Um, yeah, let's check out their X factors. Aaron Donald, Jalen Ramsey, and Cooper Cup. That's all. I'm thinking, who's going to be tough to stop on this team offensively? I really don't know. I don't think the Rams' offense is that high-powered. I don't think they have a bad team by any means, but Jared Goff does kind of suck. Okay, that's a good run. I got Devontae Freeman. I'm guessing that's Devontae. Alright, 
What is this? Third down? Third and three. Gonna send a little bit of pressure at them. Nothing too crazy. Nobody was on him. Golly, did y'all play soft. Ah, come on. We're just getting killed, bro, with these passes. This offense is murdering us. He must have heard what I said about him. Just falls forward. There's no way. And the reason why I say there's no way, because when you reach, first of all, there's someone in front of you, your own lineman, which you shouldn't be able to get it in there. I just hate that animation sometimes. But just like last week, it is 7 zip. They wasted about 5 to 4 minutes on the play clock. I'm actually going to go over the inside zone. Because we really could get past this first level. We'll be good. And it looks like we can. There's no way he actually fumbled. What's his ass cheeks not on the ground? Yeah, they're reviewing it, so I'm guessing his ass cheeks were on the ground. Good shit. Go out of bounds. There you go, Kareem. Make it easy. First down. Or is it short? It's short. Go to inside zone. We should get this. I'm going to be honest. Y'all can double team Aaron Donald. Because we need this badly. There we go. I just needed the first down. This is not even what I ran. There we go. Preston. Let's go. Big catch. Preston Williams. He had, um, what's his name on him? Jalen Ramsey. He went for the swap, but it's just a beautiful place ball. And Preston Williams for his, I want to say, second touchdown of the year? Might be third. Might be third. So even though Trey Burton is our, um, Breakout player today, he has no catches. He might have one actually. I don't even he might have. I don't I don't I'm not too sure about that, but I don't think he has any catches today. Like I felt like we were so good at stopping the run last year, in a way. You're not serious. There's no way. How did you just make so many shifty moves at once? Caught it out. Did he really catch that in though? I'll be willing to challenge this. I'm not even gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. What is Derwin doing? Hit him. These flats are covered so poorly, bro. Can we get a stop here, fellas? Please, please, please. And technically we do. We hold them to a field goal. But we are covering the fats so poorly. It's always open. There's never a time it isn't open. Good catch by Hunter Henry. I believe it's his first on the day. Let's try to get a run. I'm gonna go fullback dive on this. Please block, fellas. There we go. Neighbors. 
our neighbor. I'm calling you neighbors. Would this be a good time to play? We're still gonna run. And we still get the first down. We're just kind of taking what we could get. Offense. That even makes sense. We're taking what we could get. Offense. All right, English. Oh, I was about to say, double cover. That was a risky throw, but that's the only thing that was really open. And once again, we throw on, we throw on first down, which forces us to pass again. We're going with a screen here, and we go down by Aaron Donald. That's a big sack. Third and 20. What do we do here? He drops it. Should I want possession? Should I have one possession? I went rack because he had a step. There we go. There we go. Kenneth Murray. Making it up. Making it up. Ah! That was a good spot if I just had a little bit, like, more room to run. Williams or Hunter Henry will be wide open. We go Williams. He was blitzing. All right. On the three. That's third. It is. Kind of want a good play call right here. If we can move Burton to this. Ooh, I don't even know if we want to do that anymore. We're going to fade Williams. See what that does for us. Ah. Uh. There's just not enough room. Not enough room. We're going to settle for a three here. It's going to tie it up 10 to 10. You have to be kidding me. It made me go back instead of to the side. I was literally running straight to the side. That's easy, easy. Do it right to him. <laughs> I don't know what they were doing. And now Derwin James is in the zone. Can't make that throw. Just can't. I was going to throw it to um, Williams, I think, but just couldn't make that throw. There is nobody. Holy shit, there was nobody. Nothing was open. We are forced to punt. Good punt. That's how you do it. Wasn't the prettiest. I'm not sure if it would have bounced back. Really not sure if it would have bounced back. All right. They're usually in man, which is interesting. I think that was the first down. Justin Herbert having a decent day. 10 to 15, 100 yards uh, through three so far. Pressing Preston Williams. I don't know if that's a good idea. We'll take the flag. 
I just wish they gave us yards with the flag. That would be wonderful. We go again about eight on that. There's nobody was open. I wanted to go with Faith for Dorian Dale on the left side of the field, but nobody was open. So I take our three, 13 to 10. I was going to say 13 to 3, but whatever. Yeah, I'm not serious. Like, I don't understand how y'all don't tackle him when he's right next to y'all. Big hit, nothing. And he just fucking dives for it, which is, oh my god. There we go. Pick it up. Run, Nasser. Run. There we go. There we go. No one should catch you. Let's go. Nasser Adley with the fumble recovery. I believe. I want to say. I don't know who caught that. That was Drew Tranquil. With the sack fumble. And Nasser Adley. Runs it all the way. Drew Tranko also celebrating with him on that. That's going to put us up 20 to 10. I'm not going to lie. If we face a very high power offense like a Chiefs, like a Baltimore Ravens, like a Texans in the conference championship or the divisional round, actually, we didn't make it to the conference championship last year. If we face any of those teams, we're done. I think we have to move uh, Matt Bryant from the outside because he's just not, he's not doing anything good for us. That might be a tackle for loss. It should be. And it's not. Almost was, but it just wasn't. Tried to hit stick him. I don't even know if I was late or early on the hit stick. Where are you guys at? Um... Okay, now it is 17 to 20. Defense is fucking horrible. I don't know if it's that we have Matt Bryan as a D lineman and he's just not getting no pressure. I thought our defense got way better. But we're not really getting any pressure. Our coverage kind of blows right now. That has to be one of his first catches of the day. And that very well could have been an end to. Actually, that's his fourth catch for 42 yards. I can't tell you the other times he caught the ball. I really cannot tell you. Okay. Almost an end to. That was just a dumb play by us, honestly. Can't even lie. Oh my gosh, Drew and then Jerry. <sighs> Freeman, best, best running back. Do it all. Whatever you need him to do, he's going to fucking do it. Like, what the fuck, bro?
Yo, y'all cannot fucking tackle today. Thank you. Don't touch me. Denario digs with an intel. I thought that was Rayshon Jake. I'm like, didn't we get rid of you? Good play, you guys. Fucking hell. Because, like, I didn't know what the fuck we were going to do to get off the field. Okay, somebody's going to be blitzing. Which means somebody should be open. There we go. Believe that was Preston Williams on that one. Really good route. Good move. And what is that for? What's his name? Trey Burton. Is that anything? Five catches, 65 yards. It's like he could get that 100 receiving yards, but... Then again, it's going to be kind of difficult to do that shit. They're just eating this run up, man. Outside runs, inside runs. Quarterback runs. Just eating it up. Finally. Justin. Justin. Justin, Justin, Justin. Fuck! I didn't feel like that was a bad throw. I really felt that was a good throw. And now it's 24 to 20. There is no way! To the same guy! Like nobody over there. Did he get out of bounds? Look like it. Oh my god. Cooper Cup. It's not even be better defensively. Um the first pick you could live with, but the second pick, no way. Just no fucking way. We have to somehow score without using any timeout and then play defense. And then score again. They're playing three man deep, which is I don't agree with the call, but it's not my call. Gotta get out, gotta get out. Get yards, stop the clock. Get yards, stop the clock. Ah, I just got his foot out, man. If he never would have got his foot out, that would have been a perfect place ball. Come on. Beautiful. You have to get on the ball. <laughs> Waiting for shit to get open. I swear everything was like double covered. I never see anything like that. We're going to turn um, Cream Hunt to receiver. Make him curl to make uh, the cornerback right in front of him or the linebacker, whatever he is. To play it. My main look is uh Preston Williams and then Dorian Dale. Can I get blocks, fellas? Fucking hell. If he just doesn't do that fucking heroic ass leap. They're both reviewing. I mean, I would take it, but we all know that was nowhere close to being in. Dorian Dale looks so open on this. Come on, Dorian. There's no fucking way. There's no way. There's no way. Oh, yeah. 
They played that perfectly. They played that perfectly. Fuck. Did he get out? No, it's game over. I don't know what we got to change, but something definitely does have to change. Um, fourth quarter offense was horrible. I mean, not, it was just bad. It wasn't horrible. It was just really bad. I think we played really bad in the fourth quarter. I wish you could just set, sort these stats by quarter because that's what would be the telling of, of this game. Once again, both quarterbacks had very comparable games. Not in terms of completion, but in terms of yards, touchdown, interceptions. Very com um, comparable. Dustin uh, Herbert, 236 yards, one touchdown, three intos. Jerry Goff, uh, 231 yards, two touchdowns, three interceptions. It's night and day by those games. Devontae Freeman, who is very old at this point, uh, 129 yards, one touchdown. Cream Hunt, he got it going early, but just couldn't pick it back up again. Um... So Tony Tony Burton did uh get his scenario. He got his hundred yards. So that's good. Preston Williams also had a good game. I believe we just had really good games with our um well I think we had a really good game early on with our receiving core, but later on not so much. As you can see, even with uh Hunter Henry, we're not really he's not really getting hit. I think we need a playbook change. Or something, but it's just not looking very good. And defensively, we're not looking that good either. Not really, man. We're just not generating pressure. Not the same pressure from last year. And we had a worse defense last year, which really doesn't make sense. Fourth quarter meltdown. That's what we're going to call this um <laughs> this episode. Fourth quarter meltdown. Uh, you know, at least we got uh, him to start dev. At least we did that. That was very good of us. And we did not uh, get a chance because we did throw three intos in a game and we didn't win. So we were losing that. Um, next week we have a game against Kansas City. Big game. We are 1-1. One one. We're going to check the standings. Well, we're going to check the divisional standings. They're 2-0, and oh, so great. And we got to re-sign Drew Tranquil. So, Broncos are off to a, another horrible start. We are tied to the race for 1-1. Chiefs are in the lead for the AFC West with a 2-0 start. And, uh, you know, it might be another tough game. We're going to get to upgrades, and we're going to get out of here for this episode. Um, He's almost there for another upgrade. Might as well just give it to him. <laughs> um, Deep threat, right? Yeah, your release needs to get better. You're very fast. You're really good at catching. I think we just need to get your deep threat up. Get that release a decent uh, spot. And your release actually doesn't go up. Catching does. It sounds like what I want never goes up. We are going to go with... You played a slot a lot, so we're going to go slot for you. You're almost at 80 overall. Man coverage plus three, zone one. And you're this close to finding out what your dev is. You're so close. We'll find out by next game for sure. And we'll just keep going. We'll go hybrid this time. We'll just do a 94. But yeah, that's going to do it for us. If you did enjoy the video. Leave a like. Subscribe for more. See you next video. Peace. That nigga on a jersey, he a throwback. Should've given your location where your whole head. This shirt is my jello bitch tag. Got a cold.